put on this festival, and really, but we couldn't have done it without the amazing attendance we've had. We had an incredible show, over 400 people last night. It's just been really exciting, and I can feel the buzz in the room tonight, too. Two incredible artists for you that we will introduce in a minute. Um, a few housekeeping things, and we'll tell you a little bit about the festival later in the evening. Um, but photography. So last night we had you tweeting and social media and all this thing. Um, tonight is a little bit different. Two professional artists. Um, we just the vibe is a little bit different tonight. So no flash photography, please. Um, and we just that's getting that was getting a little distracting last night. It was very fun, but it's kind of more the college group vibe. And tonight we've got two um, really wonderful artists that we'd like to just enjoy. You know. Take in the moment. <laughs> Be in the moment. Um, we'd also like to say thank you once again to the Shed Institute for housing us this week. It's been unbelievable. And Jim and Geneva Ralph. So thank you so much. Um, all right. It is my honor to introduce our first act for the evening. She's traveled from Brooklyn, New York. And uh, she is actually a personal friend of mine. I went to Berkeley College of Music with her. And I'm so delighted that she's here. She has an incredible resume. Hopefully you guys have checked out her bio. Began performing at the age of 15, studied classical piano and jazz voice as an incredible jazz vocalist in addition to um, a very nuanced type of performance that you will see tonight. And has received acclaim from Downbeat Magazine and the Grammy Foundation, John Lennon Foundation, a number of really incredible um, music sources, and uh, she has a really, really unique show for you where she's going to be doing all of the parts and creating the arrangements on stage. So she's a one-woman a cappella artist. She wanted me to share with you that this is her first time in the Pacific Northwest, so this, tonight is her debut. We're going to give her a lot of love. Please give it up for Julia Easterlin. I'm Julia, and um, this, I should give it a name, but this is my box, and um, my microphone is plugged into this box, and I'm going to be singing into the microphone, which is then going to go into the box, and then the box is going to hold the sound and keep it there for me, and it's going to let me make other sounds on top of it, which is very nice of the box to do. And... Um, and that's how I'm going to create this music tonight. Um, so the first song I'm going to do for you is um, a Bjork song. Any Bjork fans in the audience? Oh, yes. Wonderful. Um, this first song is called Unison. I didn't actually just sing all of those parts. Um, for the sake of saving time in live shows, there are some pieces for which I have saved uh, a couple sound bites, um, just so you don't have to sit there for six minutes through the beginning of every song watching me record things over and over again. So it's really a courtesy to you. Uh, you're welcome.
have grown my own private branch out there. You gardener, you, you discipliner, don't mystically. I can obey all of your rules and still be me. I never thought I would compromise. I never thought I would compromise. I never thought I would not to. Thrive best, hermit style, with a beard and a pie, and a pair of onyx eyes. But now I I can't do this without you. No, I never thought I would compromise. I never thought I would compromise. I never thought I would win. Not tonight, tonight. We should Thank you.